Hey there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany Bundles and today's video is going to be an unboxing video. I'm going to be unboxing the new Echo Dot. I believe that's the right name. I'll have the correct name um, on the screen as well as in the title. Um, but it's the new Alexa, uh, fifth generation, and I purchased it from Amazon on Black Friday. They had a super deal. They had 50% off on Black, no, not Black Friday, Cyber Monday, excuse me, 50% off. So instead of $44.99 or like $50, it was pretty much $25. Um, it came in literally, what, what's today? Today is Thursday. I ordered it on Monday. So literally like three days and um, I'm super excited to unbox it. Now, this video is not going to entail me setting up the Alexa or anything like that. I'm going to do that off camera um, just because I think <laughs> I'll be more efficient that way. But I do want to unbox the uh, product with you all in case you are considering ordering from Amazon. You'll know what to expect and um, you'll be able to make your decision as far as if you want to proceed with that order or not. Um, so... I'm thinking that I may also add this to my Amazon store. I'm not sure, but if I do, I'll have the link for this below as well. So take a look in the um, description bar if you are interested in purchasing this uh, Alexa speaker. Uh, but go ahead and give the video a big thumbs up, please. Make sure that you are subscribed and let's get right into the video. So here's what the um, Alexa came packaged in and I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. rip in the package and it was kind of taped over like this so that's okay um but the box itself is in good condition this is what it looks like it says echo dot fifth generation um and they had uh commercials on youtube for this so that's one of the reasons that i was interested in purchasing and then also um one of my friends has this as well and she uses it for like literally everything it's kind of like her assistant and she walks around the house and says, Alexa, turn off the light. Alexa, play this. Alexa, what time is it? And I don't know if this one does all of that. Um, I'm assuming it does. It has on the back of the box, Alexa is happy to help. Um, Alexa, wake me up. Alexa, is it going to rain? So I'm assuming that this is similar to, this is probably the same thing that she has. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and unbox it now. So... Just seeing if there's anything else that I want to show you all in the box. Um, on this side, it says Bluetooth hands-free with Alexa, microphone on off button, and app privacy controls. Here is the back portion that I was just reading off to you. And then it also says smart speaker and Alexa. So our best sounding Eagle Dot, yet deliver sharp, robust sound. Ask Alexa to play music, answer questions, set daily alarms, and control compatible smart home devices. Designed with multiple layers of privacy, including a microphone, on and off button. Um, so, that is what I just read right there. I'm going to go ahead and take the sticker off and unbox the Echo Dot. Here's what it looks like and it has it's so okay so I'm going to download the Amazon Alexa app on my phone so it says that's I guess step one and then step two is to plug this in but again I'm not going to do the setup on camera but I will do like a follow-up video if you all want to know um, how the setup process went how I'm enjoying the Alexa and things like that so this is what it looks like inside of the box Here is the Alexa. It has the volume controls and I'm assuming this is the speak and mute button right there. Um, they did have different color options. Like they had white and black, I believe. Um, I decided to go with black. I was gonna get white, but then I'm like, mm, no, I just kind of want the traditional black um, just because I feel like it will go with more things. 
right now I kind of am doing like a white theme. It's like white gray, like just kind of neutral colors in my room. But so that the white definitely would have gone, but I don't, I don't know if I'm going to switch it up or not. So I just decided to go with black. I know you all probably like, I don't care about the decor of your room. Just show me the Alexa. So I'm sorry for getting sidetracked there. Okay. So this is what it looks like now. And then here's the charger. The charger is white and it looks like this. And then it also comes with instructions. I really like how it has all different languages on this too. Um, okay, so here's the instructions. It says number one, download the Alexa app from your app store. Log in with an existing Amazon account, username and password or create a new account. Be sure to turn on your Bluetooth, your phone's Bluetooth um, capability and have your Wi-Fi password ready. Plug in your Echo Dot step two. Use the included power adapter. A blue light ring will spin around the bottom of the device in about a minute. Alexa will tell you to complete setup in the app. So step three, follow setup in the app. If you aren't prompted to set up the device after opening the Alexa app, tap the line icon, this little icon. Um to add your device manually. The app helps you get more out of your Echo Dot. It's where you set up calling, messaging, and manage music, lists, settings, and news. And then they also have a troubleshooting website if you do need assistance further. Um, so it goes on, it, it gives information about privacy and support. You can learn more about the light ring. So the different colors reflect what's going on with the Alexa. So like blue, Alexa is now listening. Red, microphone is off. Alexa can't hear you. There's just different colors for different things. Um, and then they also go over things that you may wanna try with Alexa. So like asking her to forecast, um, asking her to play you know, some music, turning the volume up and down. Um, and then you also can control your smart home. Like the example I was giving you in the beginning of the video where my friend walks through the house and is like, Alexa, turn off this light. Alexa, do this. And I'm like, wow, this is like really a, a little, you know, home assistant. Um, it also comes with this. It says important information. So it gives like the product specifications, FCC compliance, Amazon terms and policies and things like that. The limited warranty for United States customers is what I'm seeing on page four and um, the warranty provider. And then they have, like I said, other languages too. So I'm sure... Um, there's like warranty information and support information as well. Um, I just, I can't read um, in any other language. So that's pretty much what you get in the box. So the setup instructions seem very straightforward to the point, which I enjoy sometimes when you purchase things offline. Uh, you may get the, the item and you're like, what the heck? Once you look at the instructions, I know sometimes I do and I'm like, oh, okay, this is going to take some time. But honestly, if I thought the setup was this simple, I probably would have done it on camera. Um, but because I'm recording with my only <laughs> camera right now, um, I'm not going to be able to do that. But I do have, well, I can record off my other device, the setup process. So I may, hmm. I'm thinking like, do I want to do a part two on how to set it up? But I don't know if it's even worth doing that because it's really straight to the point. Like I literally just read how to set everything up. So let me know, like if you all want me to do, because I definitely plan on coming back and doing like an update video. I think I'll just do that, do like an update video and show you all how, tell you all how I enjoy using it, how the setup process was and things like that. Let me know down in the comments. If you have one of these, let me know how you are enjoying it. If you like it, if you don't, if you have any tips, recommendations on the setup process or using this in general, please leave it down below as well. I do want to thank you all for watching and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.